Jesus traveled to Capernaum with his disciples Simon, Andrew, James, and John. He went into the synagogue on the Sabbath and began to teach. The people there were very surprised. Jesus' teaching was not like the scribes' teaching. He spoke with authority. Just then, a man with an unclean spirit shouted, What do you have to do with us, Jesus of Nazareth? Have you come to destroy us? I know who you are, the Holy One of God. Jesus commanded the spirit to be quiet and come out of the man. The spirit yelled again and then came out. Everyone was amazed. Who is this Jesus, they asked. He teaches with authority and the unclean spirits obey him. News about Jesus spread quickly throughout all of Galilee. Next, Jesus and his disciples went to Simon and Andrew's house. Simon's mother-in-law was in bed with a fever. Jesus went to her, took her hand, and healed her. She got up and began to serve them. That evening, large crowds of people came to the house with others who were sick or bothered by evil spirits, and Jesus healed them. Early the next morning, Jesus went out by himself to pray. Simon and the other disciples found him and said, everyone is looking for you. Jesus said, let's go on to the nearby villages so I can preach there too. This is why I have come. Jesus traveled throughout Galilee. He preached and drove out demons. A man with a skin disease came to Jesus. He got on his knees and begged, if you are willing, you can make me clean. Jesus was willing and he healed the man. Jesus' miracles proved that Jesus is the Messiah, the Son of God. They strengthened people's faith and met their needs. Through Jesus, God did what is impossible for us to do on our own. He provided forgiveness, salvation, and eternal life.